Hey everybody, welcome back to Satisfactory. And uh, yeah, we're back here on the other side of the river. And I notice our friend has respawned, which is strange because I murdered him right before I finished the last round. But I guess restarting the game made him respawn. And now he's gone, which is frightening. But anyhow, we made it to the right side of the lake river stream creek thing so yay <laughs> anyhow i have some regrets my main regret being coming the direction i came i thought this was way easier i thought like i could follow that beach the whole way and then do a quick cross here and up but that is not the case anyhow we are here though we have made our decision and we're going to continue on making bad decisions and to help us with bad decisions is tonight's drink, which is a pale berry mimosa. Pale berry mimosa is a sparkling wine and some uh, raspberry liqueur. Cheers. I see you over in the shadows. Look at you. Let's take a let's take a run at him and see what happens. <laughs> For science. Skirt. All right, where you go? Oh my God! He's ruining my truck. I'm assuming at some point they're gonna have these things react to uh, vehicles, because this seems slightly unfair. Okay, I was like, are you dead? The answer is yes. Okay, let us continue our reign of terror. And our reign of terror is heading up in this direction. Let's see if we can make that happen. Oh, right there perhaps? Now, I think the next thing we're going to need to sort of prioritize is probably going to be our zip line because ooh, that is a big old hole <gasps> there's a music tape down here uh our zip line <laughs> because that'll help us get back here way easier than taking this truck in the future so we are going to do that i think um and i think that is in the Caterium Tech Tree, which means I'm going to need to get some Caterium at some point. Now, I'm not sure where the closest Caterium is to where we're playing. I think it's... Yeah, I think I do know where it is. It's sort of an annoying... Oh yeah, it's over by the coal. That's where it is. It's over by all that coal. So maybe we'll head there. In a little while. <laughs> Not anytime soon. Although, if I'm down here, I could technically get Caterium here and then not have to drive all the way back from here. That is an option. Well, actually, I know how I'm going to drive back from here. And it's going to be a much better way than the way we got here. We are going to go through the desert rather than all these lakes. Oh, this is cool. I've never really, like, played up here before. I've come up here looking for hard drives and slugs and stuff. But I've never actually, like, built anything up here. I built it on the, the coal nodes we're going to, but... Yeah, sure, just spawn out of nowhere. That's totally cool. Yeah, I've played on those coal nodes, but I've never actually done stuff here. <gasps> oh my goochies, somebody is working on us. You know what? You guys 
You do your thing. Are you gonna fight each other? No? You're cool? Sweet. Oh, look, you have the good work. Out of the way, nature. Okay. I feel like the vehicle updates, the updates to the physics, makes them wheelie a lot more. Can I get these without getting murdered by these things? Oh, it is a doggo. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Where's your friend? Give me your precious hides. We're going for it. Oh, that's his tail. What a shot. Bloop. Oh, we're gonna get so many awesome shot points. Maybe. <laughs> Watch me get here and like... Oh, I gotta be running the power lines. I forgot about that. I'm gonna get to these uh, power plants and realize I forgot like a crucial ingredient to build these things. And I have to go all the way back. Take some of those. Can we uh, chill out with the lights? Okay, so there's a bunch of coal here, and there's a bunch of water here. Which are both things that we need. Now, I was considering... Oh my god. Just building, like, on the water with the coal generators. Just building, like, a giant platform with generators and pumps and stuff. Oh, there's a big guy back here, too. But I don't know if I'm going to do that. I might actually build, like, just the uh, the water pumps on the lake and the generators on land. Hello? Are you dead? I think that guy's dead. Yeah, they gotta make it so these guys can, like, flip vehicles over or something, so I can't just stand up here and cheese them. I feel slightly guilty. Not, like, super guilty, just slightly guilty. Ooh, computers. What amount of a do? Nope, I can't. You can have some of that and some of this. You know, take this computer, maybe these screws. Maybe I'll shoot that guy in the face. Ooh, motors too. Heck yeah. We're getting all the things. What do I need to open you? 50 megajoule watts. Okay. Oh, I mean, I guess I could just wait for the coal power plants to be up. Oh well. Yeah. I see it, don't worry. Um motors and computers can go in there. Okay. Sir, could you die, please? I've definitely shot you like eight times. Thank you.
All right, so we're pretty close to the coal. Eh, not close enough. Okay. So, how are we going to do this? That is a fantastic question. Oh, there's tons of water here. I think we're going to build these right on the lake. I think that is the easiest answer. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to build platforms across this waterfall. We're going to actually follow that exact line of water there. With our platforms. And we'll, uh, we'll just build these things. I hear you. Where are you? Oh. Yeah, we'll just build them right on the lake. And we can go over into that lake if we need. It'll be marvelous. Yeah, you better run, boy. Okay. I do want this guy gone, though, because he is going to sneak up on me and scare the crap out of me and probably kill me. So if you could go away, sir, I would appreciate it very much. Fine, you just hang out. Ooh. New technologies. Yep. Good old new technologies. Nothing beats that. Okay. So I think the play is not enough space. Yeah, that's, that makes sense. I think the play is one pump for two generators. And the pump is set to 75%. I believe that is the optimum way to do this. So why don't we do that? And also do this. No, nope, that's not what I want to do. This is what I want to do. That's too much protein to be banging into capsules here. Alright, and let's also do this. Um, oh, my miner's in here. I am going to keep this apart from the grid for now until we get up and running. So I don't want to put more on the grid, our existing grid, than it can handle at the moment. I am slightly concerned. Only slightly, but I am slightly concerned. Okay. You. Yes. Um, that is not quite aligned. I would really like it to align with this. You know what? That's <laughs> unnecessary parachute. Um, that's about as as long as it's getting, so that's fine. I feel like it's on an angle, too. I don't think it is, but it kind of looks like it. Okay. Um, how long are these generators? Are this long? Sure. Can I fit one here or will it be sad? It's going to be sad. Okay. And now. I don't think this is going to work. No, that's way too big. <laughs> Okay. So 
it's going to be kind of like that. Uh, I do want pipe on my hotbar, and I want this on my hotbar as well. Four, you do not need to be in my hotbar. But I suppose I will keep you there for the time being. Another unnecessary parachute. That's fine. Okay, I want to do this in a not stupid way. So let's try to do that, shall we? If I put you here... Yeah, okay, no, that's fine. That's fine, that's fine. Don't panic. Then I put you like so. Yeah. Yeah, that'll work. Okay. Okay. So let's see if we can't bootstrap this. What is your demand? 25. Well, isn't that convenient? Uh, there's no point in starting that up yet, though, because I don't have my coal belt going down. I'm also not sure how much coal these things actually take. I'm pretty sure I'm going to need Mark II belts. Oh, wait, you're there for a reason. Uh, no, splitter? Yes. So let's just do... How many... How many plates do we have? Okay. Let's do this now. You're going to give me 30 megawatts. Ooh. Very fancy. No! Don't fall in the water. I do like that the parachute kind of gives you like a little boost up into the air too. That is a nice feature. Okay, you're going... You. I want to go away. No, I want the second one to go away. Second one, go away. You connect. You have file stuff. You go there. And you go there. All right. Now, how much coal do you take? I cannot remember. No power. Is it because there's no fuel going to you? You're connected. Well, I guess we'll find out. I do want that fuel back, so hopefully this thing doesn't eat it all. Ooh, more Caterium. Actually, maybe what we'll do is if I bulldoze those two and that, we can duplicate this and stick it right in here. Or, oh, is the water not deep enough here? 
Why are you sad? Why are you so sad? Oh, come on. Come on. Alright. Has coal started yet? Yes, it looks like it has. Excellent. 15 per minute. Okay, cool. So I can get a lot off of this one node. Yeah, I can get eight of these things. So let's do it. Oh, I need to adjust this though. Because you are using 50... So 100 per minute. I need to reduce you to... I can just type in 100, right? Yeah, 83 percent. Nice. 50 per minute. Excellent. Oh no, 45 per minute, sorry. So, I believe that is actually 75 percent. Yeah, okay. Very good. We will just copy your settings and paste them there, except for I can't, so that's cool. And now we can do this. Did these go back four? No, there are only three, so how come you're not lining up, my guy? Do the lineup thing. Yeah, there we go. One and two. And I don't think I'm going to have room for another two and a pump. Well, maybe if I do something tricky. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to do this until we have eight of these things. And then I think that's kind of all the resources I brought. Like, I only brought enough to do that, so... There are, though... Is that more Caterium? Oh, that's copper. There are another two coal nodes here. So I could potentially... Oh, wow, this pole is in a real bad spot. I could potentially... Have, what, 24 in total here? I'm not, because I don't have the parts for it, but... That is something that could happen one day, and will happen one day. Just not today. Or, to be honest, probably not for a little while. Because once we get... Once we get a decent chunk of power going... I think that's decent enough that we can tie into our main facility now. Um, we are going to probably start working on making our big production building, which is going to take a while. I actually might not do it all on camera. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Okay. You are still red. Why are you red? Oh, because I have not hooked up water to you. That would make sense. I did hook up water to the other one, right? Yes. Okay, you're making power. Yeah, everybody's making power. Uh, Alright, let's see if we can't stick one more of these guys in here. Oh, we can. Interesting. K. 
Can I also get two generators in here? Because that'd be real convenient. I feel like it's going to intersect here, yeah. Oh, it's so close. Oh, please, just fit. You're so close. No! Well, that's disappointing. <laughs> uh, okay, let's try this then. If I put these here, is there any chance at all that I could fit one of these things in here? I feel like no is the answer. <laughs> Boo. Please? Please fit for me? Please? Okay. Well, we tried. So what we're going to do instead... Haha, I can't get me now. What we're going to do instead is build my next set off in this direction. And I think I will try to use the same splitters here for my coal generators. If that is at all possible. I feel like it should be. Let's see. Let's use some of these fancy new tools they've given us. What are you in line with? My god, it works. Yes, please. Wait. Okay, and we can stick you right here. Although, if we're trying to mirror this, let's just, well, it's not quite going to be aligned, but it'll be aligned enough. Now, power lines. I think we'll just stick a new batch here. Since we don't have these fancy dancy Caterium lines yet. Cool. These rocks are going to be in the way, aren't they? Oh, maybe not. It might be in the way of the generators, though. Can't afford. Oh, okay. I'm gonna. I might manually make these. I need fourteen more. Do I have enough goods? For 14. Oh, what am I short of? The screws. That's fine. We can make that work. We can make screws work. Oh, although I am going to need... I think the pumps also take rotors. Okay. Uh, pump. Do you take rotors? You do. You also take 10. I need 30 rotors. Okay. Let's. Yeah, let's do that. That's good. Let's do this. How's our power looking? Oh yeah. 
It's looking real good. So this is going to be our power generators and our motors can go our motors. Why won't you snap? Can you snap with those ones? No? Please? Hello? No, you're not going to snap? Can you snap? <laughs> I mean, I think that's correct. Oh, I'm doing a bad thing here. No, we're doing a bad thing. This is what we want. Okay. Now we want this. Right. That whole rotor thing that we just talked about. Uh, I need 12 more. Ooh, I'm running out of plates too. Oh no, I'm not. Never mind. I am not at all running out of plates. That is terrible. Well, we are getting a little short on time, so maybe what I'll do is I'm going to put in a cut here. I'm just going to hook in these last two generators, and then we're going to go back to our temporary base. Or maybe I'll make you drive with me to the temporary base. Yeah, I should do that. <laughs> if I'm stuck here, then you guys should be too. Okay, so I'm going to put a cut in here, and we're going to come right back. Um, for two reasons. One... There's still stuff I want to do here, and I wouldn't mind doing it on camera. And two, I'm going to readjust this a little bit so we can drive through here. So, with all that excitement, I am going to put in a cut here. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please give us a like and subscribe. It helps us out a lot. We'll see you next time. Cheers.